What's up guys, it's your boy Fatty and you know what it is. I wanted to take a second before we hop in this video to thank our sponsors Umbrella Armory for sponsoring today's video. This one's hopefully going to be a little fun for you guys and well, I hope you enjoy. Umbrella was cool enough to send me their beautiful Rec 7 and well, I gotta be honest, I'm not disappointed at all that I ditched that old Lancer Tactical. So if you're looking to get an upgrade for your airsoft equipment, or you're just looking for a nice piece to add to your collection, these are the guys to go to. Umbrella! So, today guys, we are out here. I have some camera people with me that want to ask me just a couple of quick questions as I come out to set up for my event. By the way, this is actually Fatty here. There's no actual event. This is just a character. Uh, to the scene. Anyhow, we are here over at some state park somewhere, and we are going to set up the events, get the questions asked, and get you guys some fun. I hope you guys can enjoy what you are about to see, for it is a tale of tragedy and a tale of love and passion. Enjoy what you are about to see, for most may find this disturbing. that I can see. <sighs> it seems fun to do me out. <sighs> Hi, I'm myself, D'Angelo Da Vinci, and I am the world's first insult artist. And this is my story. Are you worried to any extent that one day you can find yourself in hot water because of the nature of your art? You see, that is a good question. It has landed me in some lukewarm water. See, in the state a couple of times has tried to, how you say, restrict aerosofting in common areas. And at one point they even tried to outright ban the aerosoft gun. The thing is, this cannot hurt you. This cannot do anything to you. This here is simply a tool for the art. Now, if anyone needs proof that this is an art piece, by all means, go ahead. Right. Is it hard finding friends with the art you do? You know, some people, they get a little put off. You know, it's, it's, it's you know, a, a replica, by all means. But the thing is, People should not fear this. And that's the thing. People fear this. And they don't want to be my friend. And that's okay. There's a lot of people out there that want to be my friend. And, you know, it's, it's not always, you know, easy to decide those who really want to be my friend, those who are, you know, doing the trolling and stuff like that. But I do have a small group, a very small group, a very humble group. But uh, the art is really where my best friends come from. Look out. Oh, God, that's stinky in here. Look, guys, we've got to be quiet, okay? We have the crazy park lady out there. She's trying to stop the art. This is what she's trying to do. The toilet thing. She's trying to start crap. But that's okay, because we found a place to hide. I shall never look. The place no one ever cleans. It's gone. We could go do our art. Yay! Has the city tried to do anything to stop you from doing your art? Oh, yes, so many different things. You see, at least every month I'm going to court with them because they're trying to put in new restrictions and things like that. And the thing is, I can understand restricting kids to these things because, as I say to this is not 
something that is going to hurt you. This is a tool. This is a paintbrush. But that's okay at the same time because I get why they're scared. Because it's a very scary looking paintbrush. But I promise you guys, nothing's going to happen. Now, like I said, they've tried to put a few injunctions in. The city has tried to quite a few times. They've tried making it so you can't uh, shoot within like the 20 feet of a house. And then at that point, I made the argument that, well, an apartment could be a house for people. Trailers can be considered houses. So then they tried to push it as in public. But then the problem comes up that all these people that just go out to plink with them, they always get in trouble because of it, and they had to drop those injunctions. So has it caused me some issue with the city, with the states and everything? Yes. But the only time it's really ended in anything more than just a in the moment problem, that would have been when I went to California. I'm sorry, Cali, by the way. I came out for an art show a few years back, and I did a piece, and I called it that I had paid trough. And it was a wonderful art piece I did. It was before I got this specific brush. I had a completely different brush, and I did a piece where I, 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 I shut and then and drew and painted the, the, the California badge symbol for the state police, and the, the, the police did not like that. No, so they, they came and they, they stopped my show, and then uh, now there's, there's a new law in California where all their soft guns, even with the ugly orange tip, they have to have things like tape on the grips, and that's, that is my fault, California. I am sorry. I should have not tried to piss off those old, ugly-looking cop pigs. But I promise you, I will be back. And when I come back, we are going to have so much more fun at another one of my drawing events.